Are you one of those people who learn Blender for some time now, but still don't really know much? You follow countless tutorials, understand the basics, but you keep forgetting things and in the end aren't even able to build a basic portfolio. It's time to change that. You see, the main reason you feel like you didn't learn anything is because most Blender content is created by hobbyists for hobbyists. I want to help you making a step further and learning the professional Blender workflow. It might be something completely new, something you maybe thought you need a special talent for. So is it another donut or sci-fi dragon tutorial? No, it's interior visualization. Oh man, but I'm not an architect. I don't really... Please, just hear me out. First, you don't have to be an architect to learn the interior visualization. Why? Because it's a 3D skill like any other. But unlike the other skills, this one will positively influence the other areas of your creative life. You will learn the proper 3D modeling techniques, material creating processes, texturing, illumination, rendering, post-production, basically everything that's important if you want to continue growing as a 3D graphics designer. And even if you want to be a hobbyist, this will still make you better and more confident at 3D. Second, interior visualization may open new paths for you. For example, if you work as a freelancer, you will now have the balls to approach and challenge the architectural projects. If you work as a designer, you will learn how to use Blender to create professional interior renderings from start to finish. Third, which is quite obvious, but you can make money with it and pretty good one, trust me. And not only by the normal interior visualizations or animations, but also with the trade show renderings, um, scene stagings for furniture, for example, the VR or AR solutions. There are actually a lot of options to earn with this skill. And last but not least, it's not that hard to learn, trust me. Believe it or not, the interior visualization is actually on the easier end of the 3D graphics, especially if you are a beginner and you compare it to character animation or visual effects. So how do we... There. I always try to record those videos before the bells start to ring, before the garbage truck comes, before it's loud outside and before the light changes and I never make it. So how do we make it? Well, I will show you how to create a complete interior visualization project step by step. We will start with importing the CAD or CAD data into Blender, whatever you want to call it. We will then model the interior 3D scene using the technical documentation and photo references, create materials, illuminate, render and post-produce everything. I will also share some tips on animation and more advanced topics. The best part? It's all for free. Yeah, you heard it right. All the course videos will be available for free on my channel. Yeah, but if it's free, there has to be a catch. Well. I don't know if that's the catch, but it's quite simple. I've decided to share all of my educational content for free with everyone, but there is more to my content than just the videos. If you want to access all of the project files, Blender assets, materials, extra written tips and images for even better understanding of the topic, you can do this by simply supporting what I do. All of the extra content is available through the Choco Fruit store. You can either buy the course standalone and always have access to the extra content, or you can choose one of the subscription plans and access everything for a year. Now, is it all even worth your time and why would you trust me? Well, first of all, you can just browse through the videos after I upload them and see it for yourself if you like them or not. And second, I can't actually promise you anything because as much as I would love to know you, I don't know you. I don't know how much time and effort you're able to put into the course. What I do know, however, is what people who finish the course create. The images you can see on the screen right now were made by my students and if they could do it, I believe you also can. I also want to mention that I'm using the course to train my 3D team so they are ready to work on the visualization projects we deliver as a 3D oriented company. 
If you want to see more of what other users created with Chocofer, I leave the link to our gallery in the video description. So where do we go from here? In the next video, you'll learn more about the course itself. Can you do it as a beginner? Which Blender version should you use and so on? And if you want to be updated on the new videos that I'm adding, please consider subscribing to the channel. You can also learn more about the Chocofer content and the subscription plans in the video description. Thank you for watching and I see you soon.